Hey, this is Anthony from Absolutely Watch, Decide and Ride. Welcome to our detailed breakdown of the new Cena Cavalry Half Helmet with the Bluetooth adapter installed, available at Revzilla.com. This is the Cena Cavalry, and this is their integrated take on the half helmet with your Bluetooth communicator. And if we know Cena, which many of you do because they've been the juggernaut in this category for years and years and years, this is a 10R, and it comes pre-installed. So I'm gonna take you through the full 10R and help you understand everything that means, but what it means, it's a Bluetooth comm unit with a half a mile range, up to four riders paired, full duplex, and again, you can pair with your music, you can pair with your GPS, but the beauty of this helmet is this is a two pound, five ounce composite half helmet, super light DOT rated, that has all the microphones and the speakers baked in. So right here in the front is gonna be your noise canceling mic, and then you're gonna see that you can't even see the speakers, but they live right up here above the ears. And you can see I have two different panels installed here. I'm gonna help walk you through how that works and what you'd hear, but the beauty of this helmet is it's fully integrated out of the box. It is configured from a standpoint of speakers, from the standpoint of microphone and controls that work into this matte black design and will just work. You're coming in north of the $300 mark, but again, looking at a Cena, which comes in around the $200 mark and then a premium half helmet, you're putting both things together and you're getting the integrated factor here. There is some savings attached to that. Now, Quick note on sizing before I break everything down here, intermediate oval in its head shape here. So if you're really round or you're really narrow, this won't work. It is a half helmet, it fits down just fine, but it's a little bit longer front to back. I'm an intermediate oval, most of the US market is. Keep that in mind. And you do have the ability to remove this interior liner and wash it you know, without getting into the speakers of the way that the wiring is integrated. Keep that in mind. Use a size chart. No questions there. We're going to ship for free over 39 bucks. And I'd also love it if you click our logo, subscribe to Revzilla, leave me your comments, your questions, your feedback on the new Scenic Cavalry. Now, let's specifically talk about the speaker system here. Within the ears are going to be the Cena 20S speakers. A little bit wider, a little bit louder, higher dynamic range are taken off the premium module. You also have the noise canceling mic, which is baked into the top here, which is going to cancel noise, be voice activated, but work at varying degrees of speed. Now, rather than having you hear me tell you about it, I figured we're going to annoy Buzzsaw, we're going to put him on the bike, wire him up, and now he's going to have to do it himself. Buzzsaw, take it away. Thanks, Anthony. We're out here testing the Cena Calvary on our dyno with our open line our pipes. And as you can hear, I'm talking to you at a normal voice level, which is due to the fact there's a microphone in the peak and a digital signal processor built into the unit itself, which allows me to have a conversation at normal voice levels, even though I'm on an open face helmet and an open bike rolling about 50 miles an hour down the road. Pretty impressive technology. Love to hear what you guys think about Cena Cavalry and hear about your rides. Send us your comments and your questions. Back to you, Anthony. Don't you love it when we just get all cheesy on a Wednesday afternoon? Anyway, diving back into the Cena Cavalry, thank you, Buzzsaw, for taking us through its paces on the Dyna. I'm gonna work my way into the speaker configurations and the flap configurations, because again, that's what you're probably thinking about. We heard about the microphone. Let's talk about the speakers. Now, on the ears at lower speeds, you're gonna see that there's this pressure-mounted cup which all that's gonna do is bounce the sound from those 20Ss down into your ears. Again, lower speed, depending on your bike, you'll know when you're having a hard time hearing these. Low speeds are on a quiet bike, you're gonna be able to just wear it with an open configuration. This is phase one of getting you better wind blocking and better cupping of that sound into your ear. Phase two looks like this, and it's using this integrated piece. And you can see it here on the left, which is much more all encompassing, covers more of your ear, blocks it from the wind. And again, it's creating that cupped scoop, which almost bounces that sound right into your ear. So again, at speed, higher ranges, louder bikes, you're probably gonna wanna go with this configuration, which is gonna give you the best clarity and capture most of the sound at its volume while blocking some of the external wind noise and sounds from your bike. Again, keep that in mind. Very simple to install, very in simple to put in. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pull this one out and show you how quickly and easily that went out. So again, you get those out of the box. Now, one of the things I can dial into next here is let's talk a little bit more about the 10R functionality, which again is integrated here. It's water resistant, not waterproof. We, we ride in a ton of these here at Revzilla. And again, they don't call it fully waterproof, and if you do happen to get caught in a torrential downfloor, and at some point you get some water into a speaker, it's not gonna short out and break, it will shut off, and when it dries back out, it will come back on. But again, many of us have ridden in these, and we typically have the least amount of issues, and this is a pretty much closed loop device. Again, the 10R was one of the most all-encompassing, it doesn't have that jog dial. Again, it's gonna do a great job from Mother Nature. We think about the functionality itself, remember, you're getting 10 hours plus of talk, 13 days of standby, a half a mile range, rider to rider, 
Remember, you can connect with your music on anything with Bluetooth music sharing. It's 4.1, so it's super efficient. It's gonna allow you to stream music with, you know, again, the efficiency of Bluetooth 4.1, which allows you to not drain your battery as fast as Bluetooth 3.0. The other nice part is it's noise canceling, voice activated, it's A2DP, which allows you to control forward and back on the music by using the controls. Volume up, volume down, on and off, and changing configuration you use here. You can also do that with a voice activation, and you also get the app. And that was one of the things that came out a few years ago with the 20S from Cena, which is a bit more premium. It was app configurability. Now you have that for the 10R. So you can use your phone to set up and configure rider to rider, set your, set your stations for the radio, again, without having to fumble through it, which really isn't that bad. And one of the nice things that Cena is also doing at this point is they're giving you a really well done quick reference guide, which has a lot of the functionality baked in. So throw it in your tank bag. And now if you don't want to whip your phone out, you don't want to app configure it for iPhone or Android, you have the ability to just use the quick ref guide. Now, when we think about the helmet itself, at a little bit further of a degree of detail, and again, the 10R really is one of the better units on the market from a Bluetooth standpoint. Basic on the inside, notice it's a mixture of different materials that are gonna create different areas of either ventilation or sweat wicking. Again, no vents on this guy. If I had one more gripe with this, and again, you can see the way it's integrated, you can't even see where the speakers or where the microphone is. If I had a gripe with this, we've seen a few manufacturers out there do a half helmet with a drop down clear sun visor, I think Speed and Strength, I think Bell. I would love to see that two, po two pounds, five ounces, shoot, maybe Make it two pounds, seven ounces. It's still insanely lightweight. Give me that clear drop down visor so I don't have to fuss with sunglasses and just give me that functionality and recess it back if you can. But again, maybe that's on version two of the cavalry here from Cena. But outside of the waterproofing, that's really my only gripe. And I wouldn't even call, I wouldn't even call the drop down visor a gripe. It's more of an idea of how they can prove the product. There's my inner liner. There's my EPS on the inside of these. Again, it's DOT rated. It's not going to carry a Snell rating. And remember, it is going to be a half helmet. But all in, you're getting the best of the 10R without having to fuss or install it. You're getting a super light, tri-composite fiberglass helmet that's not gonna be polycarb. It's higher end fiberglass with a removable peak and you get everything pre-integrated, which is a really nice touch. We have not seen many manufacturers nail this at a high level. We've seen some entry level guys, but they've just been okay. This is our first one that we're really excited about. You know, outside of the fact that if you're thinking about Cena, you can always go with the 10U, which is the same configurability of this 10R. And you can look at Schubert, you can look at Arai, you can look at Shoei, and you could really use that integrated in some of those key models. Again, but it's a little bit different than having it integrated out of the box. The next step in your journey is to click the info button, your desktop, your mobile device. This is the product detail page at revzilla.com. Read other rider reviews of the cavalry integrated with this 10R. You shouldn't just take my word for it, or at this point, Buzzsaw's word for it either. As always, we'll ship for free over 39 bucks. If you want to talk to a gear geek, see us at revzilla.com or 877-792-9455. Thanks for watching our detailed breakdown. Remember, subscribe to us at Revzilla on our YouTube channel. Stay up to date with our opinion of the latest and the greatest in the Moto universe. Take them away again, Buzzsaw.